Hey everybody, it's Echo Papa, and today we're talking about part six of our audio settings, and we're talking about stereo splitters. Now, stereo splitter is an option that's available for virtual DJ, so that way if you are in a situation where you cannot plug in a regular sound card, that you can use the sound card built into your laptop, and it'll get you by. So let's go ahead and show you how it works. Go ahead and open up our config menu, and we're going to go right to stereo to mono splitter. You can see it opens up two channels. Now typically the two channels that you're going to use are uh, master and headphones. You can see it's coming out of two channels. Now these two channels, channel 1 and channel 2, they are the left and right audio to the sound card built into your laptop. Uh, this being the sound card built into your laptop here. Now there's different kinds of uh, ways you can do it. The first way that you can do it is instead of master and headphones, if you want to run it as two different channels, say deck one and deck two, you can go ahead and set this as deck one and deck two, and then now you're running two mono channels uh, from your decks, and you can run that into an external mixer, or if you're trying to split up your sound source. Um, and let's go ahead and look at the adapter for that. This right here, uh, this is an adapter, you see it's got an eighth inch port on one side. The other side has got RCA jacks. Those RCA jacks are to plug into an RCA cable, and then from there you can split it into whatever source that you want it to be. The other kind of splitter we have right here, this is an eighth inch jack to two eighth inch jack splitters. Now what this is going to do is the same thing, uh, but here we can plug one end into our output. We can plug the other end into our headphones. And then we plug it into our laptop. Now going back to our audio settings, we're going to want to do this more like it was originally. So let's go back and get away from deck one and deck two. We're going to make one side the master and one side the headphones. So now that, that master signal can go straight to whatever your audio source is, say a set of speakers. Your headphones are going to go obviously to your headphones. So that way anything that you're queuing up you're going to be able to hear. This can also be handy if you're in a situation where you're going to an event uh, but you only want to bring your laptop you can bring this and plug in your headphones and you'll still be able to cure up your music even though you don't have an actual sound card you only are working with the sound card in your system because playing mono is not going to hurt anything one problem that you may come across is you may find that the master signal is coming through your headphones and that the headphone signal is going out of the master and into the speakers now the easiest way obviously is to just take the two connections and swap them around but if you're in a situation where you can't you can just change these from mono change that to mono 2 into mono 1 and then now you've switched them around alright if you guys have any questions please put them down in the comments if you guys like this video please click the like button if you really liked it share it with your friends or better yet subscribe come back for part 7 where we're going to talk about how to hook up an external mixer